so yes nougat is finally here on la echo la 2 so how it looks so let's take a look on that part so i am arnab this is technovision and let's begin So what's new with the Nougat update? So basically it is pretty much the stock experience of Nougat what you are getting with the any other phone that is running on Android Nougat. So that's pretty much the same story here rolling out again and again. So I am going to talk about a Nougat feature. So first of all let's see that the icon tray or I can say notification tray is pretty much changed. So it's pretty much have a new kind of animation to it and also have uh, easy gesture so you can enable and disable things from direct from here so it's pretty kind of cool thing i would say and next of all you have the settings button here and it changes a lot so here you have the all kind of settings you are getting with your phone so basically at the top it shows me mobile data is off and other suggestions it's available so that's pretty cool thing so um, i can say and the settings menu is pretty much similar but what is redesigned this is that bar so what is the benefit of that if you are into any settings you can just um, quickly pull out this and go to any other settings so that's pretty nifty for this thing so this is running pretty much stock rom because it's based on lineage 14 so that's pretty good thing i would say that's not anything bad for me so other benefits you are you now have the multi window functionality so just drag and drop this file over and you are having the multi window gesture so you can set any other app at the bottom and it works simultaneously so that's a pretty good thing and if you want to cancel just drag drop and down and uh, yeah it's up to the mark so and that's how it works so you have the android ends new battery management which is pretty cool i would say so it has all the latest and greatest features of android nougat including all the gestures like you have the multi double dual tap to go to the previous app like uh, this double tap and go to the previous app again and again so it's pretty nifty i would say and you have all the android n accessories like uh, dpi changing built in so previously you have the dpi changed settings but you have to reboot to see the changes but fr uh, from now on the nougat you just have to you can just can change by simply um, dragging it here and there so it's a pretty good thing for me because i pretty much like to customize my phone as i want to be so that's pretty cool and you have so all the other options like which already have on the cm14 and this is other things so that's pretty cool but you don't have any kind of uh, theme store for um, for this room here so there is nothing app um, what is famous for is uh, lineage or cyanogen is their theme so yes you can have that by downloading a and flashing a file linked in the below so check out the description link for that so you just have to flash it and you will get a cm theme pack and you can easily change this theme theme so next let's talk about the bugs so you know it's a pretty beta version of this so there are some bugs although volte and other things are worked pretty fine geo 4g is pretty much well with this phone but a major issue with this phone it's it uh, some bugs so if you can see that flash you cannot open the flashlight so it's pretty bad thing you cannot open the flashlight by this and another bad thing is that it's bluetooth so it's pretty much uh, get uh, detected your other devices but if i want to um, connect it to my samsung bluetooth earphone it just don't want to be so that's a pretty bad thing for me because i want wireless music a lot so yep this is here and another bad thing is its camera api so now pretty much it uh, works only as a camera and as you can see it pretty much takes a long time to boot up and sometimes it just doesn't and if i go to the video mode it just crashed so yeah it doesn't work at all but what is work is candy camera or some third party cameras so basically some third party cameras works although um, most of them don't work which i tried but can surprisingly candy camera work and this camera only can you can see it's 
breaking so if you are not a selfie or camera centric guy you can just have this rom and test out but it's beta version newer versions are coming so maybe it will be fixed in the future update and also the ir blaster is not working but fingerprint sensor and other stuffs works pretty well you can click normal photos via this camera app but you can't take any video so that's a disappointment for me because i sh like to shoot a little bit of video on and camera on this phone so yep but everything else is super fine multitasking to any other thing it just rolls out fast charging is also pretty good on here and headphone support is pretty much the same so yep this is what it is and i hope you guys liked it if you like do like the like button as well as subscribe to my channel and all the links are in the down description if you want to make a tutorial video on how to and install android nougat on or cm 14.1 on this phone so let me know in the comment section and for now thank you for seeing guys see you on the next one and uh, till then you know what